Hi, in this video, we're going to take a look at how you can add or remove the Smart Select panel to the Edge panels on your Samsung Galaxy S21 series. First, tap on the home key to go back to your home screen. Then swipe down at the top and tap on the settings icon. Next, go down and tap on display. Then you want to swipe down and tap on Edge panels. In here, tap on panels and then swipe across. Tap on the Smart Select radio box to add or uh, to remove the Smart Select panel. Now, once it is selected, it will be added to the edge panels. Now you can tap on the home key to return to your home screen. Now we're going to open up the edge panels just to see the Smart Select. So if you swipe across, you can see here it says Smart Select. Capture an area of the screen as an image or animated GIF. So you can choose rectangle selection. We could choose oval selection. Animation, pin to screen. So let's test out uh, oval selection. And then I'm just going to uh, see if I can uh, select a shape. So it can be a circle or an, an oval. And then tap on done. And here you can see um, the selection has been made. Uh, I can also use the extract text down here. I can also edit or share or download. So once you're in edit mode, you can uh, write something simple. And then you can also use the eraser, undo, redo, uh, share, or you can download the image to save the changes. So if we go into gallery, uh, in gallery, we've got screenshots and here it is. And that's it. Finally, you can tap on the home key to go back to your home screen. Now let's have a look at pin to screen. So if I tap on that, I can then capture that and then tap on pin to screen. And there it is, so my um, selection has been captured and then it's pinned to the screen. So it can be quite useful when you need to compare uh, an item. So let's say if you go online and you want to compare an items, and you want to capture one item, the first item, and then you can go to a web page that has a second item and then using uh, this smart capture, you can then compare from the first item to the second items. And that's it. Finally, you can tap on the home key to go back to your home screen. Now you can tap on this um, items on the floating item on the screen and then you can either download, expand or close it. And that's it. Thank you for watching.